Hey family, welcome back to my channel. In case you're new here, hi, my name is Tricia and welcome to the Dream Team family. If it is your first time to be here, first time to see this face, kindly consider subscribing and turning on the bell that you'll not miss out any upload that you upload weekly. So today we're back with another interesting video and this video has been requested by one of my subscribers and I said, why not? I have to respond to you guys. As you can read from the title, it is the countries that are, do not require visa to come to Qatar. So I hope you enjoy it. I have done some research and I, 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 I believe that I'll give you the information that you wanted. So I have some notes written down here. So don't wonder why I keep looking at uh, down here. I just want to give you the right information and for the right purpose. Okay, so let us get into the video. If you are here and you want to know the countries that are, do not require visas in Qatar, you are at the right place. So you sit back and watch the video until the end. I will really appreciate that. So let us get to the video. So all travelers require Qatar visa not unless you have two things. One, you are a citizen from the GCC. GCC is Gulf Cooperation Council and uh, I will give you the list of the countries later and two you you do not require a visa if they are citizens of one of the eligible countries of visa waivers so those are the two things that can make you not require a visa when you're coming to qatar so i will go right ahead and give you more information about about the gcc countries which do not require the visa to come to qatar so uh consisting all gcc countries consist all the arab states of persian gulf okay and uh, they are seven which is bahrain kuwait Iraq, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, and United Arab Emirates. Those are the countries in the GCC in the GCC that do not require a visa to come to Qatar. But for them to come to Qatar, uh, they require their national IDs to enter to Qatar. However, the government of Bahrain, Saudi Arabia, and UAE have prohibited their citizens to come to Qatar as we speak for now. So those three countries, they cannot come to Qatar right now because they have uh, the government have prohibited their government have prohibited them from coming to Qatar, which is. Uh, Kuwait, Bahrain, and Saudi Arabia. So that is all about the GCC. And let us get to the second option, second point, which was of the citizens of one of the eligible countries for the visa waivers. So this one, I will indicate the countries, all the countries here, as you can see. As you can see, those are the countries that do not require that, that do not require visa to come to Qatar. And also, another thing that you can know is so there are there is another group that do not require passports to come, and these are diplomatic and services category passports. So they do not these countries do not require visas to come to Qatar. Let us go again, go through the countries that do not require the visas. I would also want to mention a few things like uh, the visa on arrival the countries that can get visa on arrival they are also indicated here I thought I should mention them also just to make things clear and there are these following countries so for the for 30 days there are two different uh, visas that can be given on arrival this is 30 days visa and uh, 90 days visa so 30 days visa it is India Iran Mok Mokau Pakistan and Taiwan 
and also along with the visa on arrival they require to have as you can be eligible to get a visa on arrival so point number one is for you have to have uh tourist trips for tourist trips if uh, holding a credit for tourist trips, if holding a credit or debit card and a hotel booking confirmation, nationals of Pakistan arriving from Pakistan must hold a polio vaccine certificate. So that is point number one. And point number two is for business trips, if holding a credit card or at least 5,000 cash in uh, Qatar Reals, a return ticket, a hotel booking confirmation and an invitation letter from a company satisfied by a, a Qatari government. So those are two things that you must ensure if you needed a visa on arrival. Uh, yeah, if you come from the above countries that need a visa on arrival. So I hope this video uh, you helped you guys. I know it is a short video, but it was so detailed. I just felt that I must have written this, all these things down for you to like get the correct information and in case you have a question and maybe you would want us to go like dig it more about it it's good for you to mention it in the comment section i will go research about it i will go check on what i will give you about it and uh, bring it to you guys so i hope for those who have been wanting to watch this video it really helped you and in case you did not get anything just go to the comment section ask a question and i will get back to you so thank you so much for watching the video i really do appreciate i don't take all that for granted as i always say i I appreciate you watching until the end and if you are new here and if not subscribed or if you are a silent viewer who never subscribes to my channel please do me justice subscribe and i will really appreciate that thank you so much until the next video bye bye